Hey there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijuteo Beading and I'm coming with another Christmas tutorial this time for fine Christmas earrings that you could do by yourself even if you are a beginner with these step-by-step instructions that I'm giving. If you subscribe with the bell, like, share and comment, you give me signals that you like my work and you want me to continue with it. Check description for a Facebook page where you could share your beautiful designs that you did following my tutorials. You might also want to support me in PayPal or by becoming a member. And the last one comes with perks that you could check also in description or at the join button. Now, without further delay, let's start with the list of the materials. Okay, guys, so what I'm using for this video are three colors of 11 all seed beads earring findings. This is Nyman Island thread that is 0.3 millimeters or size D. This is size 11 beading needle. You could use size 10 or 12 similar sizes and these are scissors. And now I'm going to take about an arm span of thread on my needle and I'll be back. Okay guys and I'm starting my work by picking up eight of those beautiful seed beads and I'm going to slide those down. I will stick my needle in my mat and here what I want to do is to make a knot and I make it by making a loop going twice through the loop I've made then I'm pulling really gently then what I want to do is to make one more knot and pull gently again okay now this is what I have, then I'm going in a few beads in this direction. Then I take two reds, one green and two red beads. I skip one bead and I go through the following. Then again I take two reds, one green and two red beads. I skip one bead and I go through the following. Then I take two reds, one green, two reds, skip one and go through the following. And again the same sequence and I go through the very first golden bead where I started my row from then I want to go through two red beads in this direction I take a red a green and a red I skip the green one and go through the following red again the same sequence And I exit next to the green. And I take a red, green, red, skip the central green one and go through the following red. The same sequence as always, go in the second red counting from the center. Red, green, red skip the one in the middle and go through the following red and continue this until the end of this row okay and this is my last step Hey, pay attention here, I'm going again through the second red one, counting from the center. Don't make the mistake to go through the third red one. I was doing this mistake when I was a beginner. Okay. And now guys, what I want to do is to exit through one of those And I take one golden, three red beads and one golden and I go in the next green one. Okay. 
I take the same sequence, one golden, three red, one golden, and I go in the following green. And then again, one golden, three reds, and one golden, go in the next green one. And I will continue, guys, connecting my green beads that are sticking out with one golden, three greens, and one golden. And when I'm up to here, I'll meet you. Okay, guys, and here I am at my last step where I'm adding my last golden, three reds, golden. And what I want to do next is go through the golden and the next red one. And I'm going to take three red beads. I skip the central one and I go through the following red. Then what I take is one green bead. And as I'm exiting from this red here, I go directly in the next red one. which is the first of the three reds that I added in my previous step. Okay, and I take three red beads, skip the central one and go through the following. I have this, now one green bead, go in the first red one, three red beads, Keep the central one and go through the following. Then again, one green. Go in the first red. And I will continue this, guys, adding three reds and one green until the end. And when I'm up to here, I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next. If you forget how I'm doing it, just rewind the video and repeat these four steps one more time. Okay, guys, and here I am at this step when it's time to add my last green bead and pay attention where I add it here through the first thread. Don't make the mistake to go through the second thread. Okay. Now in my next step, I'm going through this red bead and I'm adding three golden beads. I skip the central one here and I go through the next two red ones. And I pull. And in my next step, guys, I'm taking five golden beads. I skip the one that's on my way and I go through the next two red beads. And I pull. Then I go in the following green one. And I take two green beads. I go backwards through this green that I have here. Now I have this, then I want to go through these two red beads in this direction. And I'm taking five golden beads again. I skip the central one and I go through the following two red ones. Then I go through the green one. Take two green beads and go back like this. And also, if you can, in one movement through the following red. Then in the next red one, five golden beads. Skip the central red and go in the following. Then go in the red and in the following green one. Two green beads. 
go backwards through this green just like this okay and i'm going to continue five golden two greens five golden two greens and when i'm up to here i'll be back to tell you what's coming up next okay my friends and here i am where i need to add my last five goldens and then my last two greens and now i'm going to start my next row i go through these two reds and these two golden beads i take three goldens go through these two goldens and the first green bead you see where i'm going then take one green go in the next green and through the red after that now this is what i have then i'm going through these two golden beads take three goldens skip the central golden and go through these two goldens and the green one now take one green bead go like this in the red one then again through these two golden beads take three goldens skip the central one and you could go through two goldens one red like this on only through the two goldens maybe two goldens one red is better and then through the green one and then one green go through the green and through the red and through the following two golden beads okay guys and this is what i need to do until the end of this row add three golden beads here and one green here i will continue this and meet you at this point okay guys and here i am where i'm adding my last green bead on this row after that i go in the following red then go in all of those golden beads and through three more goldens now i'm situated one golden bead away from the green part okay and as i'm exiting here guys i take one red bead and i go in the green one then i take one more red and go here in the second golden and after that in the following And again in the second golden then one red again go in the green one another red go in the second golden okay then through this golden and through the second one from the other side one red go in the green one more red and go again in the second golden okay and i'm going to continue guys adding here red beads everywhere and i'll meet you here okay guys and now what i'm left with after I add my last red bead 
is one additional step that is not obligatory. You could finish your work this way, but I prefer to do this step as well. And how I do this, I go through the first red bead and then I add a red, a golden and a red and I go in the next red one. Now I have this, then what I do is that I reach my next red bead and I take red, golden, red, go in the next red and in the following goldens, okay. Then in the golden and in the red one. And I take these three red, golden and red and go here in the red. Okay, and that's it guys. I'm going to continue adding these beads everywhere and I'll meet you here. Okay, my friends, and here I am at my last step where I need to add my last red, golden and red. Now, what I want to do is go here and exit out of this golden bead. Okay, guys, and I'm going to take one golden bead, my earring finding and one golden bead. And I'm going back in circle through this golden that I'm exiting out of. Then I'm going to reinforce. And after I reinforce, I'm going through some beads in this direction. And here I will make a knot and cut my thread. And how I do this, I make a loop. I go twice through this loop. I make sure I'm between those two beads where I started the knot from. And then I pull. And after that, I will go in this golden bead and I'm going to cut this tail thread. Okay guys and now my fine Christmas earrings are ready so if you like them and you want to see more and more videos like this it's a good idea to subscribe also hit the bell button and in this way you will know when I make new tutorials usually twice a week and you will be inspired often. Also please like share and comment you might want to support me in PayPal or by becoming a member and more about membership perks you could find in description and at the join button. Thank you for, stay, for staying here with me until the end. Now click on the Christmas playlist that you see on your screens and continue watching.